Hey everybody, The Real Deal here. I'm here with a full case of Barbie Funko Mystery Minis. That's right, Barbie. Uh, I, am I a big Barbie fan? Well, no, not really, to be honest with you. However, I am a big fan of these Funko Mystery Minis, and I thought some of you would enjoy taking a look at these. So I got the case, I figured what the heck, let's open them up, let's take a look. Uh, I've done that with a few other things, for instance, the, the Disney Princess ones uh, that I have on the channel. The, I'm not necessarily a huge Disney Princess fan, but the figures are awesome. Um, and this looks like a really neat set if you're a fan of Barbie. I don't know if the camera is doing a great job picking that up, um, but they've got Barbies basically um, from different eras. So you've got 1959 all the way up to 1995. Um, they are all different rarities here. It looks like you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 figures in the set, and there may be exclusives too. A lot of times they do like Hot Topic or Walmart, Walgreens, GameStop exclusives. I don't imagine this being at GameStop, um, but you might find exclusives out there. I don't know. I have to look into that. Uh, however, it looks like the rarest ones are the 172 ones. So you get a 1960 Barbie and a 1992 Barbie. Um, so maybe I'll get lucky and get one of those. A few of them are 1 in 24. You've got some that are 1 in 12. Uh, no 1 in 36 figures. Uh, we do have the 1 in 6 1959 Barbie, so I'm sure I'll get two of those. Um, Funko's real weird with their rarities. You know, they're, they're inconsistent with their cases. Uh, sometimes there's no 1 in 72 figures. Sometimes now they've got two of them, but they have no 1 in 36 figures. I don't know. But most of the time, the rare figures are right in front here. So who knows? Let's take a look. Uh, and let's see how these, these figures look. I can be objective, even though I'm not a huge Barbie person. Um, so let's get the camera set up there. Sorry, guys. Camera around like crazy. All right, let's see who this first one is here. Let's see if I get a rare one. Oh, you know what? Uh, okay. Nope. Oh, so this is a 1 in 24 Barbie. This is the 1975 Barbie. And I guess is this like a ski outfit? Is that what that's supposed to be? So, and that's a nice colorful figure there, big long plastic hair there. Um, so it's a nice looking figure. Um, and that's one in 24, like I said, it's a one in every two cases, so not crazy rare. Oh, there is a one in 36. No, there's two one in 36. I missed that. So there's 1985 and 1971 Barbie. So you got one in 12, one in 24, one in 36, and one in 72. So there are the usual uh, levels of rarity there. Sorry, I just happened to be looking at the, uh, the box as I was searching for this one. So, okay, so we got a 1 in 24 figure, so it's not bad. Hopefully we'll get two or three rare ones in here. I don't know. Um, let's find out. It would be great if I get a 1 in 72 figure. That would be cool. So, so you know, growing up, I was playing with He-Man, Thundercats, Ninja Turtles. Uh, my sister was the one that played with Barbie. I never particularly had any interest in Barbie because... You know, it's more for girls, but hey, if you're a guy you like Barbie, there's nothing wrong with that, whatever. I don't care. I'm not judging. But me personally, I've never been a big Barbie guy. Now, this is another 1 in 24 figure. So, and this is the 1986 Barbie. So, uh, and she does look very 80s there with her big earrings and the makeup, the big bow in her hair. So, there you go. You got 80s Barbie. All right. So let's see who else we're going to get. Now, normally, if you get a rare one, a 1 in 72 one, they're right in front like that. So it's possible I'm not going to get one. However, I did get two 1 in 24 figures. So hopefully I'll get at least a 1 in 36. Or, or who knows? I don't know. You never know with these. So that's part of the fun of opening these up is seeing which ones you wind up getting there. So who is this? All right, we've got, looks like gymnast Barbie here. She's going to the gym. She is one in 12. This is 1983 Barbie. She's gonna go jazzercise or something like that. Uh, oh, their heads don't move. I thought, do their heads move? Nope. All right, let me not break these. Um, so they're not posable or anything like that, but it's another nice colorful figure there. All right, they've got our different colored leggings on. All right, so anyway, we've got Jazzercise Barbie there. Okay, so who's this one in front here? We got another rare one. Let's see. Or am I rare is only those one in 24s? Who knows? Let's, let's. Okay. So 
also I've got tons of other Funko Mystery Minis on the channel. So you should check them out if you're interested. Uh, this is, okay, this is a 1 in 36. So this is one in every three cases. And this is 1971 Barbie. Um, and she looks kind of hippie-ish there. Um, I don't know, she's got her, it looks very 70s there, so. Um, and I guess, um, I mean, again, I'm no Barbie expert. I would imagine these are all based on like actual Barbie dolls. Uh, so you could get an actual Barbie doll with this, this costume, I guess, in, in 1971. Um, I would imagine that's what these are based on. Because uh, Barbie's had, I'm sure, thousands and thousands of outfits in the time Barbie's been around. So, um, you know, it would seem silly otherwise. Uh, so I guess these are maybe Barbie's most iconic looks. Is that the idea, probably, with, uh, with this set? I think the older Barbies look pretty cool. Like the 1969, 1960. Um, oh, hey, guess what? It's Barbie. I got a Barbie. What do you know? No, of course, they're all Barbie. Um, I thought maybe they would have, like, Ken and... Didn't she have a sister, Skipper, or something like that? Um, I don't know. Uh, but this is 1 in 12 as well. This is 1927... Uh, 1977 Barbie, sorry. Barbie wasn't around in 1927. So this is 1977 Barbie, looking very formal. She's going to go to the, I don't know, the prom or something like that. Who knows? There you go. All right. Okay. So who's the next Barbie we got here? Um, so, let's open this up. Let's see. Oh, we've got the 1980 Barbie, uh, also 1 in 12. I probably imagine it's going to be all 1 in 12 from here on in, except the 1 in 6, I'll probably get two of those. But uh, so there you go, you got 1980 Barbie there. Again, another formal wear, um, the big earrings there and everything. So there you go. Um, all right, I don't know what else to say about these figures here. A lot of pink. Um, I guess that's what uh, Barbie's known for. Uh, they all have some kind of pink on them. Um, I guess that pink is very girly, right? And these are very girly figures, so there you go. Um, I know they've done, um, like, I'm a big comic book guy. Uh, you know, Batman and Superman and that sort of thing. Uh, and I know they've done, like, comic book Barbies. Uh, I know they've done, like, X-Files Barbies, cool stuff like that. I haven't even collected those because I'm eh, just generally not interested in, in Barbie. But it is pretty neat that they've done that sort of thing. Um, you have to kind of get that crossover audience, people that wouldn't normally buy a Barbie. Um, I wouldn't normally buy Barbies, but look, I like the Funko Mystery Minis and I bought these, so... It worked! It worked! Mattel and Funko. <laughs> Mattel makes Barbie, right? Yeah, I think so. Um, and uh, this is, I can't find it here. Oh, this is 1965 Barbie, one in 12. Uh, I like the hairstyle on this one. Uh, and the different eyes are a bit different than the other ones. This is a neat looking one. Um, she looks more like an adult, more serious Barbie. Very severe outfit there. I don't know what kind of outfit this is she's wearing there, but there you go. Hmm. That's cool. Um, all right, let's keep it going here. Oh, yep, I always manage to knock these over. Come on, stand up there, Barbie. So, um, I can't imagine how much money Barbie must have made over the years. Just probably must be billions and billions of dollars. Just, there's Barbie figures and cars. My sister had like, I remember she had like a big pink Corvette for Barbie. There's the Barbie dream house. Um, this is, looks like swimsuit Barbie here. Ready for a day at the beach. She's 1971 Barbie. And she is, uh, one in 12. Um, I guess this is beach Barbie. There you go. Uh, there 
we are. Okay, let's see. Let's see what else we got in here. There's only four more. Um, it'd be great if they hid a rare one down at the bottom for me here. Usually that's not how it goes, but I'm always hopeful that somehow or another I got one more rare one in there. Oh, um, let's see. Who is this? Oh, see, now this one looks cool. I think this one looks like old school. Uh, well, it is. It's 1960 Barbie, right? Um, there's, I don't know. I like the, the classical look uh, of these, if I were to pick one. Um, I think that's really nice, as far as Barbies go, anyway. Um, but there you go. So that's 1 in 12. So there we go. Um, all right, guys. Let's see. We're down to the last three. Uh, there's a few more 1 in 12s I didn't get just yet. Um, the 1 in 6, there's like the Barbie with the hat on. Um, let's see. Making a big mess off camera here. With all these boxes and plastic and everything. Uh, yeah, that's the one I was talking about. This is 1961 Barbie. And this is, I guess, flight attendant Barbie, right? Um or a stewardess, as it was called back then. Now it's not a stewardess, you're a flight attendant. Uh, but either way, I believe that's what this is supposed to be. It looks like, is that wings she's got there? Yeah, wings, and she's got wings on the hat. So that's your flight attendant Barbie there. So, 1961, Barbie going to work, making some money, flying around the world. All right, so now we've got two left here. So let's pull those out. All right, I'll keep this other one to the side for now. 80s Barbie stand up. Okay, there we go. All right. So, overall, this is a nice looking set. Uh, I, uh, you know, the packaging is nice too. They got all the different Barbie things there, so that's kind of cool too. Uh, I think if you're a Barbie fan and you want to pick up a little Barbie instead of a big Barbie doll, this is a nice set to get. There you go, you've got the 1959 Barbie there and her black and white striped uh, bathing suit there. So, classic Barbie. Now, that's one in six, which usually means there's two of them. So this last one is probably that figure, that same one, but wouldn't it be cool if it was a rare one? That would be so awesome. Somehow though, um, oh, let's see. Let's check it out. And yep, I was right. It's the same one. So okay. So twelve figures in the case, eleven separate ones, one double. Not that bad of a ratio. And overall, it's a nice set. Uh, I think this one is my favorite. Uh, uh, I also kind of like the the '80s Barbie here too. I think it's it's pretty funny with all the heavy makeup and everything there. So. Um, Again, if you like Barbie, you like the Funko Mr. Minis, this is a nice set. Check them out. Um, and while you're at it, check out all the other videos I've got on my channel. There's hundreds of them, so you should spend all day watching them. Uh, and I hope you like and subscribe and share. Check out the links in the description of this video. Uh, you'll probably see these on eBay shortly on my eBay page, so check that out. Uh, Facebook, Twitter, Patreon, uh, my website, realdealunboxed.com. You can sign up for my email list there, which I'm getting going pretty soon. And uh, that's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Keep on collecting.